Hey, I just learned something. Yeah, talk. <laughs> talk, talk and rotate with me. <laughs> What'd you learn? I learned what I'm doing right now. Yeah? Shooting B-roll. <laughs> Josh, you clinch across. Okay, we got to clinch across. If you want to be on the video, you can't look at the camera. All right, I'm going to go. Yeah, I'm going to have it. I've had it. So this is just another day. Since we're here at Arkansas anyway, and this is a competition, I figured to ask Virgil his thoughts on running the course, and maybe um, like how he sets up before the turns and slips down into the other runways. So, what is your kind of strategy for running this course? Yeah. So off of the off of the start line, the, the goal there is to build as much speed as fast as possible. So I'm leaving it on the ground just a little bit longer than I normally would. So I'm I'm not pulling off the ground until about 45 mile an hour. Um, no flaps in it while I'm going. And uh, when I get down to the first strip, I pull power about 100 yards off the end of the strip and put it in a real real aggressive slip to slow down. Um, typically, I'm touching down about the middle of the crosswind runway. Um, rolling out and then turn around as fast as you can and same deal rolling back out no no flaps leave it on the ground and, and build your speed up and then from there it's just a drag race down to the other end um, build as much speed as you can and uh, as you're coming over the top of the trees you can just start to see the end of the restaurant strip and about that time you pull power and I like to be settled down and on the ground well before the big tree line uh, if you come through the tree line in the air there's usually some wind there and it throws you back in the air and then you use the rest of the runway so I try to be pretty settled down by the time I hit that tree line and then the uh, from the tree line you have 500 foot of runway to get back out the other direction anything less than that and you're pretty close to the other stuff power lines and trees and so I, I usually give myself 500 feet to get up and over the obstacles coming out and then uh, coming back in I pull power um, oh about pretty much the end of the runway I'll pull power and start slipping it really aggressively get down to runway level and um, roll on and leave it rolling tail up through the finish line so and just for for clarity on the the last rollout if you will uh, before you touch down and cross the finish line do you have to have tires touching all, all three two or touching at all what's the so on the finish line there's a there's a laser beam coming across that's the timer and it is six inches off the ground so as long as you trip it you're good I leave tires on the ground because I don't trust myself to keep it two inches six, off the ground right, so right. I, I roll through the roll through the timer and then uh, get it settled down after after rolling through the timer beam so awesome they call this event Arkenstall Ozark Backwoods Challenge because it is in fact deep backwoods Arkansas and the course is well challenging. Located inside of the Birds Adventure Center which offers camping, river fishing, and miles and miles of ATV trail riding and a runway. The next event for Arkansas is scheduled for September 28th through October 2nd, 2022. Plan on bringing the entire family because this is very much a family friendly experience. Visit Arkansas.com for more information. I'll see you out there.
We are partnering with great companies like Dynon Avionics at Dynon.com. AirTech Coatings at AirTechCoatings.com. Aviation Youth Magazine at AviationUSA.com. The Aviators Clinic at AviatorsClinic.com. Take a moment to go visit their websites at the links found below in the description of this video. And visit our website at experimentalaircraftchannel.com for events, our video library arranged in easy to find playlists on specific topics, affiliate products, aviation merchandise, and so much more. Thanks for watching this week's episode of the Experimental Aircraft Channel. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you don't miss a single episode.